Well, hello everybody. I am about to restring the tree. I took all the decorations off and this is what I use. And it was so nice because I could just <laughs> pull these off. These are all from Dollar Tree and I love them. They're kind of retro looking and they have all of the little ornament balls on them and it's just perfect for this little tree. That's all I need is just these and lights. So all my lights burned out the other night because the strands are old um, lights. They are not LEDs. So I went ahead and bought some boxes of LED lights yesterday at Walmart and I'm gonna string them right now. <laughs> Just like that, I'm finished. It took me a lot longer than it took you to watch it. <laughs> so I actually have one of these left over, which I didn't have before. So I must have decorated this a little tighter in some areas. But I'm glad to finally have it done again. And hopefully I don't have to worry about it. So I used two boxes and they were each 20 feet. Howdy ho! Here we go! You knew we were gonna take a trip, right? I got an email saying I have a package so I need to pick up a package and I also need to mail a package and I need to buy some gift cards and things and I still haven't picked up my Romano cheese. Walmart didn't have any, and so I need to pick it up at Harmon's today when I pick up my gift cards. <laughs> so it's like, gift cards and cheese. That's what we're getting today at Harmon's. But I'm mailing my package at Harmon's because it's cheaper to mail it there than at the UPS store. So that's what we're doing. So I'm going to go to Harmon's first because they, the mailman comes twice in the winter for Christmas season. He comes at 2 o'clock and 4 o'clock. It's after 2, so he'll be back at 4 today to pick up the package. And then um, I'll go pick up my package at my P.O. box and it's going to be a long line. I know it is. I just know it, but it's okay. It's part of the Christmas magic. Look how cute these are. We made it back. I was gonna stop at Dollar Tree on the way home, but since I had food in the car and packages, I thought I'd just come home. But at the store, I got my gift cards and then I got a loaf of bread and then my favorite vitamin water. This is the energy one. Like I said before, it doesn't give you energy. It just tastes great. 
And then I've been wanting to try a major melon Mountain Dew for a while. And I think a long time ago, one of you recommended that I try it. So I picked one up. And then I found my beautiful 24 karat gold bell G G G Joso Romano cheese. Look at that. Oh, it's just so good on broccoli and everything else. Oh yeah, I forgot. I bought this gum. It whitens teeth and prevents stains. And it comes with two of these sleeves. I put one in my purse, but anyway, that's what I got. Um, we're gonna open a package and a card, and I'm gonna try my Mountain Dew. Okay, let's give this a try. It looks really pretty, and I love watermelon. And if this is watermelon soda, then it'll be right up my alley. That is so good. It has a really nice watermelon flavor. Mm, it's not very carbonated though. Coke and Pepsi and Sprite are a lot more carbonated than this one, but it's still good. Oh yeah. I think all Mountain Dew, in my opinion, is not as carbonated but on the other hand I think it makes it easier to just drink and guzzle down this is good it is sweet they do have a diet one um, I didn't see it though or like a zero a zero one I think I think that's what the gal told me a while back but anyway this is really good put it in the fridge so it's time to open a package and a card. This, I don't know who it's from. There's no return address, but there's cute little stickers on it. And up here it says it's from Tennessee. So let's see, cause you're the only 10 I see. Very cute and it's got glitter all over it. So cute. Let's see. Mary, well it says, may the simple joys of the season fill your heart and home with happiness. Let me. Merry Christmas. I watch your videos all the time and I love them. Hope you and your husband have a wonderful Christmas. Sandy, I can't read the last name. But thank you, Sandy. That's very sweet of you. Thanks for watching my channel and supporting it and taking time out to write me a sweet card. That means a lot. Thank you so much. If I had your address, I would write you a card back. But just know I thank you and I love it. So the next thing we have, this is from my friend Rachel. She's just a sweetheart and she's been watching my channel forever. And I just love her. And she told me this was coming today. So that's what we've got going on here. And look at this. Look at that cute, cute tissue paper. This almost looks like the vintage snowman that I made. Watch. This, these two right here. Doesn't this kind of look like it goes? How fun. <laughs> I'm just weird like that. I'm saving the tissue. Even though it's crumpled, it's too cute to throw away. It's kind of pioneer woman-ish. Let's see. She's got a cute box inside this box. Look at how pretty. 
That is super pretty. I love turquoise and red together. I just do. Look at the back. Hey! It all goes together. That is so cool. Okay. I'm gonna put this over here. Uh -huh. There's a little card on front, but it's, there's nothing on it. Okay. I'm opening the lid, taking the lid off. Oh, we've got we've got a card here. And everything's covered with tissue. She says, you're welcome to read out loud if you open me on camera. Alrighty then, that's what I'll do. Joy to the world. Oh, she says, Tracy, I've said it so many times, but Christmas time is the perfect time to remind you, I think the world of you. Your compassionate and genuine spirit come through in all you do personally and professionally you are one in a million and I am proud to call you my friend oh Rachel thank you look at this she gave me a Michaels card thank you Rach Merry Christmas this will definitely be going toward beads <laughs> oh thanks Rach you're so sweet you didn't have to do that but thank you so so much and I actually mailed your package today that's where I went I went to the post office and mailed your package today so watch for it okay I got so caught up in the card I almost forgot about the gift I just love all this. <laughs> first things first, yummy nummy truffles, Lindor's, <gasps> my favorite peppermint bark. I love it so very much. <gasps> oh, she sent me some Zoya um, nail polish brushes. I love these so much and when you go on their website, you can order these separately because the brushes that come with the Zoya nail polish, they're really thin and they don't distribute polish very well. So of course they have these that you can buy separately, but they're rounded. It's like this is what they come with, but then this is what these are. And they make putting on your nail polish so much easier and nicer. Thanks, Rach. I totally need these and I love them. Okay. Here's one more thing. You're going to have to tell me where you got all this matchy matchy stuff. Oh, let me put my glasses on. Salt and pepper shakers. Oh, those are cute. Grab it. I don't want them to break and fall out. They're nicely wrapped in, oh my goodness, these look so adorable. Oh, stop. Those are the cutest little reindeer I've ever seen. Mm. Those are adorable, Rachel. I love them, thank you. These are so cute. So I take it that one's gonna be, well, salt and pepper? That's what I would say. This one's salt, this one's pepper. Oh, that is adorable, and then they, there's a little sled down at the bottom that they sit in. <laughs> oh, how adorable. I just love it. Look at the cute sled. I think this is adorable. And they just sit in that. 
Aren't these so cute? Thanks, Rachel. I love them. And I love you. I just do. Thank you so much. You're a sweetheart. I love everything. And I'm going to have a truffle right now. And as always, all the cards that come from my special friends, meaning you guys, they all go on this door. All my customers get their own spot on my door. I just love you guys. Here's the first of the Christmas candy that I have received for this season. <laughs> I put it in my Santa snack pail. I got this when I used to have an office job way back when. And you know the LTD catalogs? Well, they had that back in the day and they also had one called ABC and they basically sold the exact same things. Well, I got this bucket from one of those catalogs and I've had it for years. And this is what I keep my Christmas candy in. <laughs> Oh, how fun. Oh, and I wanted to show you. Um, one of our neighbors gave us this the other day. It was on Sunday, I stopped by. They gave us these really neat grapefruit spoons, which I, I don't have any. And then look, he gave us a bag of grapefruit. There are four and they smell delicious. Yum. I haven't had grapefruit in years, to be honest. And when I eat grapefruit, I put a lot of sugar on top of it. <laughs> I've been <laughs> folding my, my tissue paper. I told you I was going to keep it. I've just been doing this. I don't even care that it's wrinkled. Oh! Look what we're having for dinner. Broccoli. And I'm putting some Romano cheese on my whole thing here. Daryl's, he wants his to be like that. Let's eat. Gotta have freshly ground pepper. Oh yeah. And I have extra sauce if I need it. I don't even know if they saw it. Broccoli! I don't know why I love it all of a sudden, but I do. Do you love it too? No? She's like, I love the Alfredo that you'll never get to eat. Duh. Duh. One of these days, I'll ride my horse. This is my sit-down elliptical, and um, whatever you call it. <laughs> oh, I had to have it, and now I don't even use it. It's like I'd rather walk than sit for some reason. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to try and walk for an hour tonight. <sighs> uh. <sighs> 3.205 miles. And it took 60 minutes and 42 seconds. I was on 3.2 speed. I started off at 3.0 and then 3.1 and then 3.2. 
time to go take a shower.